how are y'all doing good afternoon good afternoon good afternoon i'm getting doing my hair right now so please don't mind me and my little head wrap but how is everybody doing thank you so much for my replayers thank you thank you thank you thank you hi lloyd hello so guys i'm just like i'm so motivated right now i'm just hi single out loud thank you for sharing lloyd i'm so motivated right now that i just like i feel like bursting you ever had like a moment in your business where you just like you had a rough week and then all of a sudden the end of the week you just like bam like you you're looking forward to this week hi it's mimi you're looking forward to this week you're looking forward to all the opportunities this week you're looking forward to everything that's going to happen um, whether it's good, bad, or in between, whatever, you're just looking forward to it. That's where I am right now. I'm just like beyond, beyond excited about my business. And the week hasn't even started yet. So January, 2017, y'all need to join me, join my team and join me. I'm going to be at the Marriott Marquis in New York City. I have been to that hotel hundreds of times, hundreds of times, different events, different charities, whatever. Um, but I'm going there particularly for my business to be a speaker and to go because there's a huge conference that's going to happen. So how you can join me is by joining my team. And let me tell you guys something. Y'all need to stop sleeping on your success. Y'all need to stop sleeping on your paper. Y'all just need to stop sleeping in general. Like I'm not letting nobody, nothing get in my way. Y'all know my motto. Okay. I got children to feed. I got bills to pay. I have so much things to do in my life. And I have to give my all my honor and respect to my coach, Miss Donna Winningham. If y'all not following her, follow her up here on Periscope at Wealth Speaker. She's amazing. You know, a lot of times I'm going to tell you guys something that happened to me just yesterday. Right. My coworkers, right. They love to like go out, hang out for drinks and things like that. And this weekend they have something going on. And I said in the beginning of the month that I would go. Right. So. You know, I'm with the, my coworkers for over 40 hours a week. I'm at my full time job more than I I'm at home with my children. And all you guys who are parents, y'all know that we spend more time at our full time jobs than we do at home with our family. And you know what I mean? And that's just the way it is. So I decided to cancel on them because I'm like, wait a second. I'd rather be home with my kids sitting here on my kitchen table creating my my millionaire master plan than sit here and spend money on drinks. And y'all know how I love my wine. Y'all know. OK, but at the end of the day, my focus needs I, I have to refocus myself and I have to figure out what my priorities are as a as a businesswoman. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to figure out a way. I even told them now, listen, I'll be with y'all every single day. Here working full time with y'all. I'm trying to figure out a way where I only see y'all once a month. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to figure out a way to get out of this job. I'm trying to figure out a master plan. Thank you for sharing with your followers. Um, to figure out how I can, you know, write up my two weeks notice or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like I am absolutely so determined, so motivated. And yeah, you know, it, it don't matter what day of the month it is. Like right now, what well, we have 12 more days. Yes, I checked. I checked this morning. We have 12 more days to the end of this month. I don't care what business you in. It's still enough time for you to, to, to make your goal. OK, and to figure out what opportunities you're going to do to reach your goal. It's never too late. Never too late. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to be at the Marriott Marquis in January 2017. And I would love for you guys to join me. So you need to if you need help making money, if you need help getting out of that full time job, definitely join my team, my website, my phone number. Every single thing is in my bio. I sat here on my couch. OK, while my kids were napping, I sat here and I wrote out a plan for the rest of this year. Hi, Natalie. I sat down. I wrote out a plan for the rest of this year and I am sticking to it. I am not playing. I'm not doing none of that every day. Just like my coach said, I'm going to check my bank account every single morning and I'm going to figure out a way to increase that. OK, and it's all depends on me. I can't let my husband get in my way. I can't let my kids get in my way. I can't let my full time job get in my way. I can't let my own screwed up emotions that I have in my head every single day get in my way. You have to be determined. You have to be motivated. You have to be unstoppable. So if that means that if that means me getting up every single morning at 4 a.m. while the kids are sleeping, figure uh, 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 
responding to emails, responding to text messages or whatever. And that even means me staying up late into the night. Then that's what I have to do. But really, guys, you know, at the end of the day, my children are not getting any smaller. They're getting bigger and bigger and eating more and more. OK, my my bills are not getting any um, cheaper. You know what I'm saying? So I need to stop making excuses and and procrastinating and coming up with all these reasons why I can't work my business today. You know, so I hope this motivated you guys, because I'm telling you, if it wasn't for my coach, if it wasn't for my coach, I don't know where I would be right now. I, I, you, I, I feel like my my mindset would be I probably would have quit. You know what I'm saying? I probably will quit because at the end of the day, the minute as women, the minute we wake up, the world is against us. The minute we oh hi Coretta, the minute we open our eyes and wake up, the world is against us. You know? So we have to rise above all that. All that all the hate. All we even hate on ourselves. Like forget about everybody else hating on us. We even hate on ourselves. You know what I'm saying? Like, thank you, Coretta. We need to just rise above all that and still think about our goals and still think about our dreams and think about the aspirations of our children. Y'all see me when I first spoke, came on and spoke about how I want to be this perfect, outstanding mom. And I freaking let it all out for you guys. I was crying, girl. I was a mess because my biggest fear, my biggest fear is for my kids to say, mommy, I'm hungry. And I open my refrigerator and there's nothing in there. I've been through that. I grew up homeless. I grew up going from hotel to hotel. God could have, I could have been in a totally different direction. Y'all say, oh, you're so happy. You're so bubbly. Yeah, because I choose to be. Because I'm supposed to be that black angry woman fighting everybody with an attitude. And they'd be like, oh, what's wrong with her? No, I chose a totally different direction in my life because I wanted more. I chose who I am today. I chose to be the Letitia that you guys are seeing right now. Because I'm telling you, I was not supposed to be this way. I was not. I was not. That is not what my, my, my destiny was supposed to be. I was supposed to be this angry black woman mad at the freaking world. But I chose to be who I am today. And you guys have to choose. You have to choose to want more. So like I just said, my biggest fear is for my kids to open that refrigerator. There not be no, no food in, in there. Or they don't have a roof over their head. And that's what keeps me going. Because I refuse. I refuse to fail. I choose success. I choose. That is not, it's not even, it's even more, it's more than just a choice. It's a mission. I, it's my mission to wake up every morning from this day forward. Thinking about ways to make sure my fridge is full. And you guys may say, oh, that's not everything. It's everything to me. It's everything to me. That's my bottom. That would be my bottom for my kids to open that fridge and there'd be nothing in there. That's my bottom. So I'm going to make sure that as long as th that's just, ugh, I'm going to make sure that I don't fail. I'm going to make sure that I don't fail. I don't make sure I don't fail my children. I'm going to make sure I don't fail myself. I'm going to make sure that I don't fail at all. So you, if success is a choice, uh, 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 you want to be a failure is a choice. What do you choose at the end of the day? What do you choose? It's, it's, it's no excuse in the world that should keep you from being a millionaire. There's no excuse in the world that should keep you from you being successful. None. None, not, neither, none. Those people that you have around you that are blocking you from your success, even that person you're sleeping with every day, that is your choice to listen to them. It's my choice to listen to them. Okay? Am I going to listen or I'm going to be successful? At the end of the day, that's all that matters. That's all that matters. Trust me, guys. I'm telling you. I know how it feels to be down. I know how it feels to be discouraged about your business. I know how it feels to sit around. You just have a whole bunch of people just saying something negative. I know how it feels because I was supposed to be at a different place. I'm supposed, I'm supposed to be today a totally different person. I choose to be who I am today. I choose it. Okay? What do you guys choose? Success or failure? Because you can't have both. What do you guys choose? Success or procrastination? You can't have both. What do you guys choose to make? Money or excuses? Because you can't have both. You got to choose either or. You got to choose either or. And that's it. So I hope this guy has motivated you. This all motivated you. And guys, again, if you do not have a coach out there that's coaching you, motivating you, and pushing you to where you need to be, you definitely need to go right now and sign up for my coach, Donna Winningham at Well Speaker, because I'm telling you, she's going to kick you in the butt. Like y'all heard me, she be coming after me with a switch, honey. <laughs> Thank you, Coretta. Thank you. I just, oh my God. 
Oh my God. I just said on my, on my Facebook page, if y'all tired of seeing me, y'all better get ready. Cause y'all ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> y'all ain't seen nothing yet. Cause I'm I, the one thing I tell you, and it could go back. I remember one time, um, Okay, so I went to college after high school, right? And I remember one time I took up networking administration. Back when I went to school, networking administration was a man's field, okay? Only men took that, took that degree, right? My second year, the, one, my professor came up to me. He was like, you know what? You are going to switch majors because women don't ever stay in this field. They, they switch. And you know what? The only reason why I got a bachelor's degree right now in networking administration was because that professor told me that I couldn't do it. I only did it just to prove him wrong. That's the type of woman I am. So you guys go ahead and just talk about me. Go ahead and say negative things about me. Go ahead and think I can't make it because I'm going to do it just to prove to you that I can that's the type of person I am. I'm so determined. So keep on talking about me. I want you to. I want you to. Because like the Lord said, he will make my enemies my footstool. So y'all, y'all best to stay quiet. Y'all better off not saying nothing at all, to be honest. Okay? You know what I'm saying? Keep talking. And that's how y'all have to be. Let your haters keep talking. Let them keep talking because God will make them your footstool. He will, he will pep you up with that determination. So I'm about to get off because my coach just signed on. So guys, I love you guys more than more and more and more and more. Coach Donna Whittingham is on right now at Wealth Speaker. So definitely log on to her Periscope, guys. Love you. Bye.